Hey guys, Reckless Owners here, back in our video. In this video, we're gonna make this disclosure kind of style drop. So the final result will sound like this. So altogether, the presets sound like this. The chords and the bass line. So first, we're gonna make the chords. By the way, if you want this presets right away and fit more other presets in the style selected and disclosure, make sure to check future selection form 2 down below. In our preset pack, we've got 50 more other presets to make this kind of style of music. So now let's dive into the chords. So first, stack in our presets and go over the sine wave. Put it up on octave. And for unisons, detune a bit down. Yeah, shape envelope too like this. And route it to the D tune. Now I'm gonna shape as B. Go for the basic mini. Wave saber right here. Just one unison and put it up seven seven tones. Just gonna hear it as we get some more harmonics to the sound. I'm gonna enable the filter. We're gonna go for the low 24. So cut off around here. And flip two to it. Two around here. Then some drive, fatness. And now we're gonna shape and flip one. Something like this. To make this sound more analog, we're gonna route and flip one to the chorus pitch of both oscillators. Stack fast. And drag it down to around 1. And that's it for us later, so now let's dive into effects. First of all, we've got a hyperimation with a little bit of hyper and some animation. And that's a distortion. We need some down sample. Just gonna hear this will add some more highs to the sound. It's a bit too much, so lower on drive. Through around here. And lower on mix quite a bit. So you can barely hear it. We're gonna bring it out with a filter later. So now we're gonna add a chorus. It's like a high pause. Just gonna hear this give this kind of effect. It's a bit too much, so mix around here. Then we're gonna add some EQ. Or the low cut, because we have the bass layer. Right, envelope 2 to the frequency. So it'll take away some of the lows. And we're gonna boost the highest bit. To on here. Shape it like this. Then we're gonna add some reverb and delay with a low cut. Same for the refurb, because we have the bass line for the lows. Something like this. And the last thing we're gonna do is set all bus filter. This will bring out the high somewhere. So cut off around here. A little bit of drive. And lower down the master volume because it's clipping quite a bit. Just something like this. And that's it for the chords, so now we're gonna make the bass line. So the bass preset sound like this. It's quite a simple patch because I want to keep it quite analog as they are in those disclosure kind of style tracks. So for us layer A and B, we're gonna use a square wave. We're gonna use those basic wave tables for the more analog kind of sound. Name of the filter. We have oscillator B for unisense. The D tune a bit down. Then we're gonna shape the filter. Get some dry fatness. And shape F01 like this. Short decay. And sustain right here, some release. And route it to the cutoff. To around here. Then we're gonna add some mono gato. Always. And that's already it for the oscillator, so now some effects, some dimension, no hyper. So open the bass sound a bit more. And some chorus. 
to around here. And add some downstep distortion to give more more character in the highs. So search for the sweet spot right here and lower down the mix. And that's already bass sound, so all together sounding like this. And in the track they sound like this. So add a quite simple drum loop, some claps, and folk chop, and some final sounds to finish it off. So it sounds like this. As you can see, we got quite some some Jesse R&B kind of chords. And that's it for the disclosure kind of stuff drop. So if you like the video, please leave a like. If you want to see more, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you all in the next videos.